Fallout night in Middletown sends one officer to the hospital. Good afternoon. I'm Ashley Kirkland. I'm Lisa Cooney. Police say another officer was threatened with a knife and then his police cruiser was stolen. WWT News Vice Karen Johnson live in Middletown to explain it all. Karen. Well, good afternoon, Lisa. Two police cruisers were heavily damaged overnight. This right here is one of them. Officer Ryan Morgan was in this car. He was taken to the hospital for minor injuries, treated and released. Now, the man who police say caused all of this, he was also taken to the hospital. And when you look at this, police say they are very lucky this was not worse. Now, this all started around 1 o'clock this morning. Officer Patrick Glass burn was called to Bavarian Street for a disturbance and an intoxicated person. Police say the caller's boyfriend, Jason Cooper, was hiding in the bushes and jumped out with a knife when Glassburn arrived. Officer Glassburn fired a taser at him. It didn't take. Then police say Cooper hopped in Glassburn's cruiser, took off, crashed it into a second cruiser driven by Officer Ryan Morgan. The cruiser Cooper was in flipped on its side and police say he continued to resist arrest. He was eventually taken to the hospital with a punctured lung from the airbag. Um, we did find though uh, that uh, Mr. Cooper uh, was scanning our police channel um, through his phone app um, prior to officers arriving. So if he truly wanted to flee, he had more than enough time to get out of the area and flee. Um, you know, he was waiting for the office to, to respond. And Cooper faces a bunch of charges. Now, one thing I want to point out, we've done plenty of stories with Officer Morgan in the past. And up until last week, when he was promoted to detective, he was a canine officer. His canine, Chase, was always with him every time we saw him. He was not with him. He stopped. He retired last week. The dog retired last week. So the dog would have been right here, but he was not. So very lucky on that part too. Reporting live in Middletown, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5. What